Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to make Ben 10's Omnitrix. Using these dimensions, I drew and cut out the strap of the Omnitrix out of EVA film and sanded down the rough edges with the Dremel. While making the strap, I used a heat gun to soften the foam. After the foam got soft, I wrapped it around my wrist so that the strap could take its shape. I glued a thin piece of foam underneath one end of the strap. For the other end, I used an X-Acto knife to cut out a small rectangular gap. I glued velcro on top of the thin piece of foam and in the gap. Using a large pill container, I traced and cut out a circle out of EVA foam. I glued a thin strip of EVA foam on top of the circle around the edges. I realized that it was too big, so I made a smaller version with 3mm and 5mm craft foam. I used a small circular piece of cereal box cardboard and some Lego pieces to help the Omnitrix stay secured around my wrist. I cut out a gap into one end of the strap that was big enough to fit this specific Lego piece inside and glued it in. With the circular piece of cardboard, I poked a hole with a pencil that was big enough for this specific Lego piece to fit in and super glued them together. Before gluing it in, I sanded down the end of this piece so that both Lego pieces don't fully lock together. After gluing the cardboard circle on top of the other end of the strap, it should look like this. I glued the foam circle on top of the circular piece of cardboard. I also made a button out of craft foam. I painted the whole Omnitrix with one layer of Mod Podge and two layers of black acrylic paint. I put masking tape around the areas I wanted to keep black. I then painted the areas that weren't taped gray. I painted the inside of the circular piece light gray and drew the iconic Ben 10 symbol with a sharpie. I painted the symbol light green and drew the outlines. I also painted the button light green and gray. Using reference pictures, I painted the edges of the circle gray and added light green drops of paint on top. Using some 3mm craft foam, I cut out two strips with the following dimensions and glued them onto where the gray and black paint meet. While gluing the strips on the Omnitrix, I curved the ends towards the circular piece and painted the strips white to give them a glossy look. The Omnitrix is now complete. 